hi guys welcome back to my channel so today i have another video for you guys i'm going to show you how i did this goddess african threading on my natural hair so i basically threaded my hair as i usually do and then i crochet these curly pieces so i'm going to show you guys exactly what i did if you're not already subscribed go ahead and click that subscribe button down below turn on your notification bell and let's jump straight into the video okay so quick overview i threaded my hair as i usually do you guys know i have so many threading tutorials on my channel so i didn't feel the need to go into detail but if you want a more detailed threading tutorial click the eye at the top but yeah i just basically threaded my hair as i usually do 26 27 sections so now time to add the curly pieces as you guys can see i already added some of those pieces into my hair and i just have the front sections left and i'm going to show you guys what i do with the front sections So the hair I'm using is from QVR hair, as you guys can see. It's their 22-inch kinky curly texture. Although I feel like this is kind of very loose for a kinky curly, but this is their kinky curly texture. Um, so I'm, each pack comes with a crochet hook, as you guys can see, and this is what it looks like out of the pack. So this is what the bundle looks like as you guys can see the curls are very very defined very soft hair um it's human hair very nice shine as you guys can see so in the bundle the um in the bundle the hair comes in single strands like this and each strand as you guys can see has a thread in the middle for the crochet and i think this is a really brilliant thing that they did with this um the way they designed their crochet hair first of all the thread is very strong so it's not going to cut or unravel easily and it's designed so well as you guys can see i'm pulling on the hair and there is no strand no shed hair nothing like that so if you use this to do crochet it's going to reduce the amount of frizz you have because the hair is not shedding also when you crochet the hair it's going to give a seamless knotless look you know how sometimes when you do actually not sometimes every time when you do crochet there's usually knots where you loop the hair but with this you wouldn't see any knots i'm about to crochet my hair right now so that you guys will see what i'm talking about so i'm taking the latch hook i'm passing it through the thread in my hair then i'm going to put the thread of the hair of the hair piece and pull it through like this as you guys can see easily pulls through because it's a thin thread and then i'm gonna take one piece one side and just pull it through the loop and secure it as you guys can see there is no knot where i did the loop right at the point where i did the loop and secured it so it looks like the um crochet hair is literally just coming out of my own hair i'm going to show you guys from a different angle up close so you close the latch hook pull it through then you take one side of the hair put it through the loop and just secure it and it looks it is not less there is no knots so it doesn't make the crochet look weird it literally just looks like it's coming out of my own hair very seamless very knotless i absolutely love the fact that it did this honestly using this crochet hair was so easy to work with and so straightforward and everything went really fast um, you guys know I have tried a lot of crochet hair to do this goddess look um, over the past couple of months and I kid you not this is the best one I have used till date the absolute best one I didn't have to like define the curls or anything before I installed the hair that saved me a lot of time because usually I would have to define the curls and cuts and do a lot of things but this I could just literally crochet directly into my hair and it was just a very easy and straightforward process and there were no knots honestly if you want to do crochet goddess looks this is the best hair to use like this will save you a lot of time it looks really really good and you can control the amount of hair that you use if you want to make it fuller you do that if you want to use less hair you do that i actually went back after the next day to add more hair into um, add more crochet hair into it and this is what it looked like when i was finally done this style is so gorgeous i'm actually going to be taking it on vacation um this i filmed the ending this um outro i filmed it three days after i installed the hair and as you guys can see the curls are still defined i'm pulling on it there's nothing it's not coming out it's very secure there is no frizz because the hair is constructed really really well in the strands i absolutely love this i have nothing bad to say about this this is one of my this is my best crochet experience i have ever had whenever i'm doing crochet this is the hair i'm going to be using I'm also going to film another video showing you guys different ways to style this. I wanted this video just to be dedicated to the crochet process. But I'm definitely going to give you guys a styling video because this style is so gorgeous. And there's so many different ways that you can wear the hair. 
um yeah let me know what you guys think down below don't forget to like comment subscribe and share you can subscribe to my channel by clicking subscribe button down below on my face on the screen also do not forget to watch my other natural hair videos and i'm gonna put the links to where i got the hair down in the description box i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys